In this video I'm going to be showing you how to install the newest version of uh, Google Chrome browser and this is pretty simple um, doesn't require a lot of technical work but um, I just decided that I will do this video for you to show you step by step and how to get over any problems uh, with that said, um, let's go into it. Okay, so I'm at google.com at my homepage. I am going to just type in whether you're using Google or Bing or Yahoo. Just go in and type in Google Chrome. and usually it's going to be the first result that comes up and I'm just going to click on you could click on any one of these links but I'm going to click here to install Oop. okay Now that I've moved my camera over a little bit to get this in view. Uh, okay, so now we have the results coming up and we are going to go ahead and click on the page and it says download and install Google Chrome. That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to click and download Google Chrome. We're going to accept the terms of agreement and I advise you to go through and read this, especially the part about the privacy and accept and install and we're just going to wait for it Now my computer is running a little bit slow because I am doing, uh, I'm running a lot of programs and I'm doing this recording at the same time. So we're almost there. And one thing to note, if you do not see this window for any reason, you could just click this button to refresh the page and so it will start the installation. Okay, and now we are ready to start the installation. And I'm personally going to uh, uncheck this because I do not want this to be my default browser. But if you do want it to be your default um, web browser, then you could leave that checked. And I, it's asking you if you would like to import bookmarks, password from Firefox, and add it to the start menu and quick launch. I'm going to customize these settings. I do not want it to import any of my settings from uh, Firefox. Um, I'm not going to create a desktop icon and I'm not going to add a link, an icon to the quick launch bar but I might just leave this to import the settings from from my, from my Firefox pages so it'll save my bookmarks and let's start okay now it's telling me that um, I need to save my work and close Firefox and click continue 
I am not going to do that so I am going to skip the import I could always add those later on okay so let me move this up now Google Chrome is now installed and uh, when you do install it you will see this tab it will show you uh, a little video about the Chrome browser you could go ahead and watch those tutorials if you so choose and I am going to pause it I'm not going to do that right now and there you have it Google Chrome is now installed on your computer um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be doing a separate video for you to show you how to adjust the settings on your browser um, depending on how you use your browser if you just use it for regular search if you use it for internet marketing purposes whatever your purposes are I will go ahead and show you some of the few tips and tricks that you'll find useful when using the Google Chrome browser okay uh, and with that said I am just going to go ahead and do a quick search I'm gonna go to bing.com actually that didn't work out how I wanted to so I'm gonna go to my computer is really slow okay let's do a search for golf golf swing okay and there we see it pretty fast and we could open multiple tabs several tabs and also if you wanted to what you could do you could customize this browser and if you want to open a new tab on your keyboard hold on control and T together so hold control and press T while you're holding down the control button and it'll open a new tab so I'll new tab new tab control T control T control T control T and I'm opening up several tabs and you could just go ahead and close them close them close them and to close them quickly you just hold down control W control W on your keyboard and you close the tabs quickly okay so with that said that's it um, I'm looking forward to doing the next video for you so keep your eyes out and this video has been brought to you by Paul from instant computer answers for more tips and tricks and how to get the best performance out of your computer visit instantcomputeranswers.com thanks again bye bye